After months of leaks, rumors, and speculation, Apple has officially announced the iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max. They are the most expensive new iPhones yet, with prices starting at $999 for the 6.1-inch iPhone 15 Pro with 128 GB of storage and $1,199 for the iPhone 15 Pro Max with 256 GB of storage. Here are the 10 biggest changes and new features in this year's iPhones. Number 1. The Action Button The iPhone has had a ring and silent switch since the very beginning, and the iPhone 15 Pro finally changes that. The switch has been replaced with the Action Button. By default, just press and hold the button to toggle between ring and silence, just like the switch used to do. You'll get a haptic response and animation in the dynamic island. But there are a number of other modes available too. You can set the button to launch the camera, start a voice recording, activate an accessibility feature like launching the magnifier or flashlight, or running a shortcut. That last one is especially exciting, as it means you can quickly perform complex actions, or even just launch any app you want. Number 2. A 17 Pro processor. It wouldn't be a new Pro iPhone without a new A-series processor. While the iPhone 15 will use the A16 Bionic introduced in last year's iPhone 14 Pro, the iPhone 15 Pro and Pro Max get a new system-on-chip dubbed the A17 Pro. The A17 Pro is the first 3nm chip in any major consumer product, which increases efficiency and allows Apple to increase transistor count to 19 billion. There are still two high-performance CPU cores, but they are 10% faster. The four high-efficiency cores are also faster, though Apple did not disclose how much. The GPU is paired with a six-core GPU that uses an entirely new shader architecture. It offers 20% faster peak performance and better energy efficiency, according to Apple. It also provides new graphics features like mesh shading and finally, hardware ray tracing acceleration which Apple claims is the fastest in any smartphone and up to four times faster than software ray tracing. Number three, camera upgrades. Apple says the new camera system in the iPhone 15 Pro is the equivalent of seven camera lenses in their pocket. We have macro mode and 13 millimeter ultra wide as before, though the new ultra wide camera gets a new anti-glare lens coating and better night mode quality thanks to the A17 Pro. The iPhone, 15 Pro's new 48 megapixels main camera is a larger than the one on the iPhone 15. It shoots a new default 24 MP HIF image, in addition to 48 megapixels in bright light. ProRes is still supported as well. Number 4. Better battery life. Apple spent no time talking about specifics related to battery life for the iPhone 15 generation, as there's no claimed improvement here at all for any of the iPhone 15 models. We can expect similar battery life to the iPhone 14 generation, which was generally excellent. The iPhone 14 Plus especially wowed us and still holds the best result out of any phone in our battery test. Number 5. Displays. Changes. Apple made no changes to its usual display size on the iPhone 15 generation. However, the iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus received updated displays with a brighter 2000 nits compared to the 1200 nit iPhone 14 display. It's disappointing that Apple's iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus still have a comparatively low 60 Hz refresh rate, which is a rather major compromise for a phone that starts at $800 in 2023. Even the $500 Google Pixel 7a has a smoother 90 Hz display. Some reports suggested Apple and its partners weren't able to add a high refresh rate display to the iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus due to limited production capacity. Number 6. New Design All iPhone 15 models received Apple's latest design with softer contoured edges compared to the sharper edges on the iPhone 14 generation. The contoured edges should make the iPhone 15 generation more comfortable to hold overall. A titanium frame with a brushed metal aesthetic replaces shiny polished steel on the iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max, which makes for a lighter weight overall. Indeed, the iPhone 15 Pro is 6.6 .6 ounces compared to the 7.27 ounce iPhone 14 Pro, and the iPhone 15 Pro Max is 7.81 ounces compared to the heavy 8.47 ounce iPhone 14 Pro Max. 
The iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max also feature thinner display bezels that make for a more premium look. They're also easier and likely cheaper to repair than previous iPhone Pro models. Number 7. Dynamic Island The Dynamic Island appears to be the same incarnation that debuted on the iPhone 14 Pro in 2022. It's essentially a secondary display that can be used to view media playback, sports scores, rideshare status, and other bits of information without flipping back and forth between apps. Apple's Dynamic Island also made its way to the iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus, replacing the notch that was first introduced with the iPhone X in 2017. Number 8. Different Colors The iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus feature Apple's new color-infused back glass, with a frosted matte texture available in five color options, including blue, pink, yellow, green, and black. The iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max's titanium frame are available in natural titanium, blue titanium, white titanium, and black titanium color options. Number 9. USB-C Port Apple replaced the Lightning port with a USB-C port on the entire iPhone 15 lineup. Charging speed remains at the same 18 to 20 watts as it was with Lightning. However, it's now possible to charge another device from an iPhone 15 with a USB-C cable, like the latest AirPods Pro 2 with USB-C. The USB-C ports aren't the same between the iPhone 15 models and the iPhone 15 Pro models. The iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus only support USB 2 transfer speeds, which is typically 480 Mbps, while the iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max's USB-C port support USB 3 speeds. The iPhone 15 Pro models support up to 10 GB per second speeds, which suggests they use the USB 3.1 Gen 2 standard. Number 10. Roadside Assistance via Satellite Apple's latest safety feature, called Roadside Assistance via Satellite, connects users stuck with car problems in areas with no Wi-Fi or cell signal to AAA for help. The service is included free for two years after you activate a supporting iPhone, and it works with AAA memberships. For those who aren't AAA members, it works on a cost-per-use basis. Roadside assistance via satellite was introduced with the iPhone 15 generation, but it's also supported by the iPhone 14 generation. It complements the existing safety features, including crash detection and emergency SOS via satellite. So far, that's all we know, but we will be uploading new information as it comes in. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If so, please make sure hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more informative videos.